What is going on, everybody? It is Edison T. Crux, and welcome back to Animal Crossing New Leaf. We haven't done this in a while. It seems like it's been, seems like it's been a while. Kind of that, that weekend schedule, you know how it goes. So we're getting back to the groove of it, and I hope everyone is having a splendid Tuesday. I know I am. And uh, let's dive in and cross our animals. Cross our eyes, dot our T's. Wait, no, no, no. I'm getting that mixed up. I'm getting it all mixed up. <laughs> fantastic, fantastic. Getting the stream started just a touch earlier than scheduled, which is kind of how I typically do this, I guess. Um, fantastic. Fantastic. That's right. Uh, Mayor Edison, hey, I've seen you around lately. How have you been? I know, I know, I know. I, I, I don't get in here often. This is one of the reasons, again, why I'm probably, why I'm not going to be doing this series too much longer, is I just, I struggle to keep up with it, you know? Struggle to give it the attention it deserves. Alrighty. So let's just see what we got in the mail. We just got a letter from Nan. Moving day is finally come. Oh, to be honest, I'm a little reluctant to leave this town and all the friends I've made here, but it's time to move on. I'll miss you. Take care. Best wishes, Nan. Sorry to see you go, Nan, but I understand. I do understand. All right. Wow! Oh, my tree fell apart. Well, that's kind of sad. Let's find a organize these. What is this? Daisy tea. That's gonna have to get. What? Oh no! It's a rotten orange. Ew! I was like, what? Why is that not? Why is it not working? But it's a rotten orange. That's gross. That's gross. Yucky. <laughs> awesome. Velma's here. I have to go say hi to Velma in a minute here. Fantastic. Alrighty. So let's clean this area up a little bit. <laughs> clean things up. I see one of these guys over here. It's a pitfall this time. Okay. Very cool. Very cool. Velma, see how she's uh, doing. Hi, Velma. Hello there, Edison. Running into you is always a nice surprise, Billy. <laughs> I got the capsule. Yeah, I don't know if I was supposed to give that to her or not, but I guess we'll give it a try. I guess we'll give it a try. Benedict says hello. Hello, Benedict. How's it going? Drug it up? That's okay. I was going to ask you to do that soon. So thanks. <laughs> okay, this is my old red flannel shirt. <laughs> Plot thickens, <laughs> and I think it's from me to the future me. Why did I need this berry? Well, it looks like a hand-me-down. I know I'm picky, but when it comes back, <laughs> um, it will look like a dig-me-up. Oh, uh, instead of a hand-me-down, it's a dig-me-up. Oh, past Velma. <laughs> How are you doing today, Benedict? I am doing a lovely. This is really about. I can be so silly sometimes. <laughs> That's funny. You tell me about well, nonsense. You have what you buried for me. Oh. Great, thank you. Another shirt I don't want. Red flannel shirt. Oh boy. You know how much I love me some flannel. The answer is I don't. But <laughs> Oh well, that's alright. It's the thought that counts, right? It's the thought that counts. Alright. So, we're going to need to earn all the monies today. I can earn all the monies. As you can see, I'm rocking. Last time I switched out my beloved Majora's mask to wear Midna's mask for a little while. And the silent treatment. I'm sorry, guys. I've been talking forever. You should pay more attention to me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Again, I, I, if, I feel like if you're going to do Animal Crossing, you should re like either really do it or just not do it at all. You know? It's not really a good one to... um. Just do part way, you know? And that's kind of what this ended up being. Ended up being just kind of part way. I'm already going to need to stop by retail, it looks like. Benedict says he's doing fine. Fantastic, fantastic. Right. Swing on over here. Clear out some of this <laughs> shirts and stuff that I don't need. Clear out the way a little bit. It's Pierce. Let's see how to Pierce. Pierce, what's up, dude? What's up, Hawkeye? There are a lot of items here. Maybe the good stuff sold right away. Should have come here sooner, Hawkeye. Maybe. Maybe you should have. All right, I want to sell. 
Let's see, I want, I want to sell that Daisy Tea, Flannel T-shirt, Pitfall Seeds. They'll probably charge me to get rid of that Rotten Orange, but that's okay. That's okay, I want to get rid of it. Bless the Seeds, yeah, I figured. I figured as much. Shady's here! Hey, how's it going, Shady? How are you doing today, my friend? How are you doing today? I'm doing pretty good today. Doing pretty good, doing pretty good. Been hanging out, watching the kids. Um, they're feeling a lot better today than they were uh, before. They, <laughs> they weren't doing so hot um, for a little while there, but um, they're, they're, they're perking up again. Still not 100%, but probably like 80%, I'd say. 80 or 90. Maybe even 90 at this point. They're, they're, they're doing pretty good. Not 100%, but good. Definitely doing better. It sounds like Shady says he's doing good. That's awesome. That's awesome. Have you been using your new beacon that we got yesterday? <laughs> Don't forget to um raid the um raid the iron farm. Particularly if you're on the server a lot, like and if you're on and no one else is, like then even all the more reason to just like help yourself. Um Oh, Jesus, sorry for the keyboard sound and crux chat. Oh, no worries. <laughs> Trust me, I my current keyboard isn't too bad, but my keyboard in the past was a pretty pretty noisy one. Um, so much so that Matthew, my son, always wanted to... He actually um, inherited my old keyboard because he loved the sound that the space bar made. <laughs> because he could hear it in my videos, so... Not a worry. <laughs> but yeah, like, the iron farm is running whenever anyone's on... Oh. <laughs> whenever anyone's on the server. So if you're on the server and no one else is, and you've been on there quite a bit, and that means that you're, um, you're earning the iron, earning that iron. So might as well help yourself. It takes a lot to get that full, a full beacon going. Benedict, it's good to hear they're feeling better. Yeah, I'm, I'm really glad they're feeling better. I'm really glad they're feeling better. Um, Cookie Black says hello. Hello, how's it going? I don't recognize you. Are you new to the stream? Good to see, uh, good to see you here. Benedict says they were sick over the weekend, if I recall. Um, yeah, yeah, it was really over, over, um, like, Saturday when I was really noticing it. They gradually since then have gotten better. Sorry, fundraise build a cafe! Yeah! So excited. Um, they've been gradually feeling better since then, so that's really good news. Well, that one's, that one's kind of hidden. I almost didn't see that one. Katie will take use of the iron farm. Yeah. Yeah. You uh, you do that, man. You do that. This looks like a fake one. I think that's fake, but I'm not... I don't 100% remember, so I'm just gonna be ready. Oh, look at that! Look at that! Look at that! Um... But yeah. The, uh, iron farm. Definitely take advantage of it if you've been on a lot. I know you've been on probably as much, if not more, than anyone else on the server, so... A lot of the iron that's accumulating is from you being logged on, so help yourself. <laughs> awesome. Money Rock is taken care of. So guys, I got a confession to make. Seeing this mid Midna mask is reminding me. I have a confession to make, guys. And this is going to come as a surprise to some of you, particularly those of you who know me quite well. I have never really played Legend of Zelda uh, Twilight Princess. Like, I played a little bit of it, but not, like... I think I got, like, up to the first dungeon, but didn't even get through it. Like, what is with that? Like, how have I not played that game? I really am gonna have to get on that. I'm really gonna have to get on that. Because, like, it so seems my style. Like, I kind of prefer the, like, games and stories that are a slightly darker tone. Which is weird, because I'm such an upbeat, perky guy, but I just kind of... I like my stories kind of dark and gritty. <laughs> um, and it seems like it's exactly the kind of game that I would just absolutely eat up. Um, and Link's a werewolf in it. He can turn into a wolf. And in case any of you don't know, I kind of like werewolves. That's kind of that's kind of my thing. Like, why have I not jumped on this? You know? <laughs> so I think that's something I'm going to have to... Going to have to make happen. This looks like rock that doesn't belong there, but I guess it does. I'm gonna have to make this happen. I'm gonna have to donate as much as we can. We so we still need about two hundred fifty thousand. That's a big goal. Big goal indeed. Oh, what do we 
got here? And... Chaboing! What do we have here? I saw another one of those things. Those, uh... Those, um... Those things there. We got... It is balloon floor! Yay! Let's see. Shady says, I'm gonna hop on the server, raid the iron farm, but I'll still be watching this. Fantastic! You know, honestly... Honestly, um, particularly since you just got yourself a beacon, I know you're gonna be in a hurry to get that filled up. You can just go ahead and take all the, I mean, leave like one as like a placeholder, but all the stacks. Just go ahead and clean it out and more will come on as we play. Um, I don't think anyone right now has too immediate of a need for any. And I know that, you know, when you get a, a beacon, you're gonna wanna get, get a full beacon pyramid. So I, I say, I give you credit. Go ahead and just, um, dive in there. Benedict says, your first two books are very dark. Yeah, um, or rather dark. Yeah, they, they definitely are. Um, they definitely are. Um, and third one, it's, I was working on that again. I'm finally getting back into a writing group, which is really good. Once I, once I get this first draft done, I'm going to have a release date for Mothman's Return. Tentatively? I've, I've had tentative release dates before, and I've kind of fallen behind on them by, like, a year. But, um, tentatively, I'm thinking Mothman's going to come out in April. If I were if I were a betting man at this point, I think that's all. Yeah, fossils and gyroids and all that good jazz. Splendid. So it should be coming out in um, April. And that one, it's not, like, as gory as, like, Twin City. Twin City was kind of gory and bloody. Um, but Mothman's Return is just creepy. Like, it's creepy. Which is awesome. I, I like, I, I don't know, maybe it's just me. Maybe it's just me. <laughs> but it should be, it should be really cool. I'm excited to do it, at least. I am excited to have that book out. I really enjoy, like, I had to, to get back into the group, because I had stopped writing for, like, way too long. So I had to to kind of get the groove back going, I read through, I, I was like 75% through the book writing it. And then I, that was when I stopped. So I had to reread through all that. And reading through that 75%, you know, that three quarters of the way through the book, I realized I really enjoy that book. It's a really good one, Mothman's Return. It's going to be, I'm really excited to share it with people. I'm really looking forward to it being done so that people can also enjoy this book. And it's not yet. Ooh, that's good. Last time I think we had all uh, repeats. Alrighty. Rather jealous. Yeah, of course I'll donate. Of course. Alright. Let's see what he needs. Make a donation. Because a two. Well, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. We got two, uh, two original, or, um, new things on there. That's awesome. <laughs> Fantastic. Nope, that's good, Blathers. We're good now. All right. Fantastic. Fantastic. Let's go sell some gyroids and stuff. Take care of all, all our usual stuff. So what's everyone else up to today? It is what Tuesday? What's everyone's What's everyone's Tuesday looking like? What are we What are we doing today, huh? Um. Shady says I'm using the PC to comment, and the layout is so much better. Oh yeah, layout didn't turn out as good on um. What else were you watching on Shady? Because yeah, I know sometimes like if I'm doing like um. Like a Chromecast, like on the TV. Sometimes the layout, like, does not. Um, it cuts off part of it, which is kind of strange. Was well, good that there's. It, this is a gyroid day. That <laughs> sounds so weird. It's a gyroid day, but um. But that's nice because I can sell those for a little extra, a little extra cash, and that will come in handy because again. We're getting close, guys. Again, my plan... Nice, another 10 grand. My plan is once we get that cafe, is probably when we 
gonna be wrapping up this series for the time being. I'm not gonna be like deleting the save or anything, so it's possible someday I may pick it up again. Um, but it's just the passion I had when I started just isn't still there, and that's kind of how I am with Animal Crossing, to be honest. Just not a series that like I could do forever. Ah, uh, Shady was watching on my iPod. All right, cool, cool. Let's go ahead and gather any more of these. You know, why didn't I replant one of those perfect oranges? I just sold all those and I didn't replant one. That was that was not my smartest moment. <laughs> that was I just realized like why did I do that? That wasn't particularly clever. Oh well. I'm not <laughs> I'm not that clever. <laughs> to be honest, I'm not that clever of a person. Oh well. Oh, hey, hey, it's Bryson's here. There is no Dana, there is only Zool. <laughs> How's it going, man? How's it going? Or do you still prefer Josh? I know last time you said Josh has been... Josh is gone. He's no more. He's no more. <laughs> um, fantastic. Good to see you here. Good to see you here. All right. Let's try and gather up... I feel like I may as well just get all of the fruits that are of value. At least the out-of-town fruits. Like, I'm not as concerned about the oranges, because they don't really they don't really net me a whole lot, you know? But the out-of-town fruits, they're worth, they're worth grabbing. Put these pears over here, yummy tasty pears. Oh, excuse me. Burping on camera. Rude. Rude, right? Am I right? Oh, call me Mr. Gameplay. Okay. Is that kind of like Mr. Rossetti? No? <laughs> awesome. Mr. Game and Watch? Mr. Gameplay and Watch? Mr. Watch's Gameplay? <laughs> hey, there we go. That's kind of appropriate. Mr. Watch's Gameplay. Because at the moment, you are watching Gameplay. Um, Shady says, Who lives in the unnamed village beside the chicken coop? Um... That was someone's temporary base. A couple people have, like, um, short-term bases or, like, a couple temporary ones. Um, instead of having, like, one major, major, like, stronghold kind of place. Um, I don't know whose exactly that was. It may have been Quill? It may have been someone else, like Wolfgang? I'm not 100% I'm not sure. Not 100% sure. Let's see, Farmville says Mr. Gameplay. What about Farmville? Sounds fun. Sounds farmy fun. <laughs> Alright. This should be a nice batch of fruit. Nice batch of fruit to go sell. Get a couple of bells. Hey there, Annabelle. I know, I know. Everyone's mad at me because I don't talk to them enough. <laughs> I don't talk to them nearly enough. I'm such a bad friend. Such a bad friend. Let's see, Benedict says, I forgot if I told you, but I found a random shiny Wurmple while I was training my Axiom, my Pokemon Omega Ruby, evolved into Dust Stocks. Oh, that's cool. I don't think, I don't recall you telling me that. That's awesome, Benedict. Congratulations. Congratulations. That's always cool when you encounter just a random, shi like a random unexpected shiny, you know? Like it's, shinies are cool even if you're like, you're hunting for them. But I feel like the surprise ones, the ones you weren't expecting, are just such a cool little treat. Like, you're just going about your business, and then suddenly, whoa, hey, it's a shiny. That's awesome. That's really cool. That's really cool. I'm surprised, with my luck in my last two um, Nuzlocks, I'm surprised that in Moon, I have not encountered any shinies yet. Like, I had really good shiny luck in both my other playthroughs. I mean... Heart Gold wasn't, like, super good shiny luck, but I got one, you know? And I haven't, haven't encountered any on, uh, haven't encountered any on Moon yet, which is kind of, kind of interesting, you know? I guess my, my shiny luck may, must have finally run dry. All right, let's see what is in here. Ooh, what is, what is this little beauty of a thing? Hello, a lab bench. Ah, uh, don't mind if I do, yes. That it will go perfect in my house. That's gotta happen. Yes, yes. I should probably keep paying attention to the walls, too, because I could possibly use another wall. Ranch? Nope. Nope. 
stuff and then not ranch. <laughs> I'm, I'm picturing like like the like ranch salad dressing. Skywall. Uh, probably not. Yeah, no. I mean that's kind of cool. Again, it could look like I'm on some kind of like flying uh, ship. Actually, that would be kind of cool. It would look like I'm on a ship. Already, I think it kind of looks like I am, but um, that would look really cool. Mr. Game, please been watching Attack on Titan. Very cool. Um, very, very cool. I've never seen Attack on Titan. It's one of the many things. There's a lot of really good, like, shows and games that I really have not, um, either played or watched. Generally, I, there used to be an old, like, running gag among me and some of my, uh, my old co-workers back when I worked at Starbucks, um, was that any good movies, um, any good movies are, I've clearly never seen. Like, why am I leaving here? I can, I can, I can eat my fortune cookies inside. I don't. He's not gonna kick me out to eat my fortune cookies. <laughs> Benedict says, "Your fire red, shiny luck was something else." I know, right? That was, that was nuts. Absolutely nuts. All right, let's see if we get anything cool from here. I don't really know what I'm hoping for at this point. Fortune inside. Let's see. An itchy nose is worth the sacrifice for a glorious upper lip. Ooh, I, I think I've had that. That sounds familiar. Um, so gameplay says it's in, on Netflix in full Japanese. Cool. You cannot put a value in your life unless you have a hundred gold coins. Huh? That sounds like isn't that um? I feel like that's a Mario one of some kind. I feel like that was something Mario. Cause wasn't there like I don't know. Wasn't Mario you could like buy a new life for? Hundred coins. So right, let's check out the itchy mustache one. I feel like that's one of the like the big bro stash or something. Is big bro stash? There we go. Pretty positive Quill has that, and I don't typically keep Mario stuff, so I can sell that, which is cool. Totes cool. Totes cool. And let's get a lucky ticket. See what this one is. I feel like uh, I don't think I've actually. This one I think is new to me. I don't think I've had this one. It is a coin. Oh, it's just a coin. Okay. I don't know. Quill's not here at the moment, so I don't know if he's got that. I would imagine he has a coin, but I'm gonna hold on to it just in case he doesn't, because he might not. He might not. I got. And I gotta go lay down this new lab bench I got. That's gonna be awesome. I might have to do some serious redecorating in my house. Because I've got some really cool things. But I can move some of my stuff upstairs. Which is not a very big upstairs. Because all my money has gone, uh, gone towards projects around the uh, town. Alright. So let's go sell off the stuff that I know. Basically just this big rose stash. Because I know I don't need that. So I may as well just get that out of my inventory. Get it out of the inventory and attended to here. So, surprised Shaka Na isn't here yet. He's usually, usually he's first in line with anything Animal Crossing. Yeah, I'll get rid of that. He's usually first in line. <laughs> Oh, it's a video dude it says hi Edison long time no speak. How's it going? How have you been? Long time no see huh? or speak as you say. Awesome. How are you doing? Oh, hello Velma. What's up? That's right. I think we need a new way of saying hello. Not my usual hello there. Why hello there? I should do that. Why hello there? How about it? Sure. Great. What should it be? All right. All right, we're gonna do this. We're gonna do it like this. There, that's how we caps off. Why, hello, Var! <laughs> perfect. It's perfect. Oh, Shock and I was just talking about you. I was like, man, where's Shock and I? He's usually. He's usually, like, first in line whenever there's some Animal Crossing involved. <laughs> and then, boom, as if, like, I summoned you. <laughs> there you are. How's it going, my friend? Why, hello, there! <laughs> I love it. I love it, love it. Why, hello, there! Yes, you over there! Why, 
<laughs> perfect! It's perfect! Totes perfect. For some days I wake up the wrong side of the bed. Oh, Josh is back! There is no gameplay, only Josh. No? Doesn't work the other way around. <laughs> awesome! So how is everybody doing today? Alright, let's go put down some decorations we have here. Let's see, Shadow Knight's here! Awesome! How's he, how are you doing, Shadow Knight? It's just all the all the crew is here. All right. So, um, those of you who are just tuning in, because it seems like right now is when everyone just now tuned in, which is fantastic with me. I got a lab bench, and this is not where I'm going to put it. I just want to show you guys what I got. Look at this thing. How perfect is this for my place? Like, seriously. That's awesome. Can I lay on this? Oh, my gosh. Look, it's electrocuting me. It's got little electric -y thingies. That's amazing. Oh my gosh. So that can be like a bed. I mean, I got a really cool bed. But this is even better. This is even better, guys. This is awesome. This is awesome. This is giving me my new bed. This is great. This is great. Let's see, if you just it's not much Umbreon told me you're streaming and came to check it out. Awesome. 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 All right. We're going to plop this lab bench down here. Um, not quite there. It's, oh, man. What did, you're going to make this difficult, ain't you? All right, all right. So let me just adjust everything. <laughs> you know what? I feel like I'm going to have to start moving some of my Zelda stuff. I have to do some arranging here. Uh, there we go. <laughs> That's so cool. <laughs> Shock and awe says, um, just got back from the bank, actually sending you an extended exposition piece, aka email. Nice, with some stuff I mentioned. Fantastic, fantastic. Looking forward to that. Um, thought of you when I was in my town at the end of last week. Nook had a moon lander for sale. <gasps> nice, that would have been cool. All right, I gotta organize myself a little bit here. So, this place needs a little bit of Hyrulean treasure. Needs a little bit of Hyrulean treasure. Who doesn't need some Hyrulean treasure? Alright, let's just... Can I... I should be able to place it from here, I would think. I know it was up there. Yeah. It's just kind of big and bulky. <laughs> That's bedsome, says Benedict. Awesome! Awesome! Yuki Gaming says, salute! Hello! That is so great. That is perfect! I am super pleased with that. Do, 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 do. Josh says, I have not been one of your live streams. So, oh, okay, okay. Well, hello there, Josh. Hello. <laughs> Yuki Gaming says, uh, bon, uh, Bonjour, come on. Unfortunately, I do not speak French. I am sorry. I would I would love to, though. But I am not currently um, fluent in any language but my native of English, which is a little unfortunate. I'd like to. I remember this. This is so great. How random... An automatic sushi thing. That's just crazy and cool. Um, Shady says, uh, I'm first in line when when there's Minecraft. That's right, you are. You are indeed. All right, cool. So that's all tended to. So let's take a look upstairs. Um, so, okay. The main basic stuff is mostly done. Now, this area, I like this as like a little like writing nook. This, <laughs> this obnoxiously huge um, bookshelf is just absolutely epic. All right, let's, oh, no. Oh, okay. I feel like I need to move this, though. I feel like this whole upper area just needs a little bit of adjusting. Honestly, that lamp's probably not even necessary. But it does add a little bit of extra light. Can I... There we go. Ow, ow, don't get stuck. Don't get stuck. Completely blocks the window. Wow. Okay. Can I, can I flip it? What if... Let's just take all this stuff, do a little rearranging. No, not that way. No. Oh, there we go. All right. Cool. Cool. That looks good there. Let's just, let's just take everything out. Let's just take everything out. And look what we got here. Do a little bit of stuff. Um, <laughs> Josh says, I'm first with Skyrim. <laughs> there is no price in only Josh. <laughs> awesome. Uh, Shock says, can you change the wallpaper floor in your upstairs or expand it? It seems small in the upstairs in the classic. Yes, you can absolutely do both of those. I really should get different 
stuff up here because <laughs> it does look pretty pretty archaic. Um, can I turn? Okay, the light was off up here for some reason. Um, yeah, you can expand it. I just haven't. All my money has been going towards town projects, so I haven't really been spending much on other things. All right, so let's see. Stack of books, I think, done. Let's see. Home computer rack, desk like, writing chair, writing desk. Home computer rack. Which one is this? That's cool. That's very cool. But I feel like this corner is where um, my writing setup should be. My writing desk first. Drop a writing desk. And then I need a writing chair. Which goes he with the writing chair goes right there. There we go. I can pop in here, do all my writing, you know, because that's what I do. Um, let's see, Shock says Edison. It would look dope with the shelf there and the desk right next to it against the window, like um, where the other room piece was. Um, let's try to see uh, with the shelf and the desk next to it. Yeah. I think this might be what you're thinking. I'm not sure. This, I think, looks pretty nice, though. The sun streaming in there. Um, I think that looks pretty nice. And I'm thinking of down here, put the stack of books. Where is that? There's the stack of books. I just kind of cluttered about, you know, make it kind of, make it look a little bit messy. Um, Josh says, I need to get the game Monster Hunter Generations. It's for 3DS. That's, I've heard really good things about that. Oh, sun's getting straight in my face again. Straight in my face. Let's see if I can do anything about that. It's, no, not really. <laughs> not really much better. Um, <laughs> Shock says, um, what? Helping the townsfolk before yourself? Blasphemy! <laughs> it is a little bit blasphemous. All right. Now, I don't think I can set anything on this. Like, it'd be great if I could put this desk light on my writing desk, but I don't think I can, which is a little unfortunate. A little unfortunate. And I don't know... I don't know where this computer would actually look okay here. Uh, I want to leave some room so I can, you know, browse all my books. Uh, I guess I could put it in this corner. It's probably as good a place as any. I just not put up this desk light. Yeah. And then I, g I guess I... You know what I could do? Okay, here's kind of an idea. Put this here. So then, like... I don't know if I like it. But, like, my thinking was I could be sitting here, like, okay, I'm writing, writing, writing. And then it's like, all right, I need a break from writing, and I'm going to go on my computer and play some Skyrim or something. So I can just, you know, <laughs> shimmy this, switch over. My computer doesn't quite doesn't quite work. That was kind of my thinking. Like, it's a, kind of like a functional nook. Um, I don't really think... It works quite as well as it did in my head. Look at little hearts. So let's just flip that back. Um, very cool. Yeah, I know. I don't know. I've got honestly right now. I'm not gonna be looking for any new games right at the moment. I've got a couple in mind that I kind of want to play um, for like streams and such. And I kind of just want to focus on some of the other ones I've got. Like I'd really love to manage to get more Skyrim in during the week and more. Minecraft and that kind of stuff. So right now I'm kind of, I'm right now kind of in the phase of parring down on series instead of bulking up. You know what I mean? This bathtub. I still feel like it'd be great if I could actually get into that. Um, she says, what I'm going to do with my old base is give it to the next newcomer in the server. Oh, cool. It's a cool idea. Um, very cool. I, I, we actually are going to have a newcomer on the server. Um, most likely. I, not as much as, oh, hi. Hi, Alex. <laughs> <laughs> um, but, uh, Shock and Awe may be joining us come March. Uh, he's not much of a Minecrafter, typically speaking, but, um, sounds like he is, uh, the newest of our patrons, so when that time comes rolling around, he will be invited to join us. I don't know if, I th it sounds like you were planning on that, right, uh, right, Mr. Silent Protagonist? Um, if not, you're gonna see us do some other stuff. If you guys haven't, you should check him out. He's got some, he's got some cool stuff. He's got some cool stuff. All right. I'm gonna put this coin in here just in case Quill needs a desk light. 
You know what? I do think I know one spot. I'm gonna put this green bed there too, cause it's a neat green bed. But I think there is actually a spot. <laughs> Benedict says the sunlight in your face looks pretty creepy. I know it's like I have half a face. <laughs> it is pretty creepy. I'm not gonna lie. All right, but actually, that guy could go here, and I don't think it'd look too bad. I mean, it looks kind of haphazard, but that's kind of a writer's life. It's gonna be, you know, a little haphazard, a little bit chaotic, books and stuff everywhere. This, 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 this actually in real life, I would work here. I would write in a room like this. This actually looks pretty fantastic, even though it's small. It's cozy, and it's got. It's bulked up on the thing that matters the most, and that is books. So, I would I would totally write here. Let's see, awesome, awesome. Josh says maybe you should do two streams when you do Animal Crossing because these streams are not that long, and the second stream can be Skyrim or Oblivion. Yes, oh my gosh, Oblivion! I have not played Oblivion in ages. That one kind of got just like pushed to the sidelines, man. It got pushed to the sidelines. <laughs> Send Dream says, oh my gosh, Wild Edison must catch it. Must catch it. <laughs> How you doing, Send Dream? Doing it well, I hope. We're doing pretty good here. And actually, these streams, sometimes the Animal Crossing streams go pretty quick. But sometimes, like today, I usually, like, an average one of my small streams, which is to say a typical... Animal Crossing or um, Minecraft, a typical short stream is about 40 minutes to an hour typically. And right now it's been almost almost 40 minutes so far. So it's not too bad. Obviously it's better when you can live stream more, but with my um, with my um, situation, sometimes it's a little more challenging. Since when I'm here, when the wife's at work, I'm also watching the kids. You guys know the drill. You've all been here. You've all heard my heard my spiel a few times by this point. Um, so sometimes doing longer streams while I'm up here watching the kids as well can be can be a little more challenging. Man, this this light. I'm gonna try and see if I can adjust this. Maybe something. I don't think I'll be able to get the sun out of my face too much. That's a little better, though. A little bit better. Um, <laughs> Shock says, hashtag Wild Edison bravely fled. I did. I did bravely flee. I sure did. All right, I'm actually going to... Since I've, I've got us here... Um, since I've got us here, I'm going to go ahead and gather um, just some stuff from down on the beach, too, just to earn as many extra little bits of bells here and there that I can. Oh, and there's... There's what, these coconuts? These aren't... Yeah, coconuts. The green coconuts. Which is cool. Grab some cokey nuts and bananas. I like to eat, eat, eat apples and bananas. Coconuts and bananas. I gotta be careful. Alex hates my singing. He hates anyone singing. He's very angry about it. <laughs> if I do too much singing, it's gonna he's gonna get gonna get mad at me and he's been such a good boy for this stream. I don't wanna I don't wanna trigger him if he's been doing so good. <laughs> awesome. Josh is Josh has returned to his evil throne. Bryson has been defeated. <laughs> I feel like there's a whole little like um whole little story unfolding here. Sounds like something I would I, I would write about actually. Multiple personalities. Evil personas. <laughs> see, Shock says, maybe um, I would have to make sure I even understand how it works. Be nice to have an initial setup to use as a base of operations or a boo. Boo hoo. Boo, boo hoo, Shock. <laughs> oh, man, that's cool. That's cool. Yeah, it's a cool house. There is something I actually really want to show you folks. I may load up here quick, too. Um, it's more Minecraft related, which is why it's kind of, kind of strange to demonstrate it here. Um, oh no, didn't want to quit. Didn't want to quit. Um, I um, what was I saying? It's more Minecraft related, but something really cool. I was able to get a map of the server rendered out, like with everyone's builds in it and everything. I'm trying to find, um, I'm trying to find 
a way to upload it so that other people can view it because it uses like um it uses what's it called? Um, I'm actually gonna try to load this up quick while I'm thinking about it um to show you guys because that would be really cool. Um, but it's um it looks really neat. It looks really really neat. I've had to make a quick thing. Yes, here. Let's just see if I can. Hang tight, folks. Alrighty, can you hear me? I know it's a blank screen. Working on it though, just a moment here. I'm just getting my getting my voice here, and then we're going to I made my stream crash. Well my, my streaming program crash. As a matter of fact. Alright, so <laughs> let's just test this out. It's gonna be kinda cool, I think. It might not be, but I think it's kinda cool. Um okay. Let's see if this will Load up. I may be just overloading things, um, but this could be really cool. Can you see this? No, you can't see it. Oh, that's unfortunate. All right. Let me change a thing quick. Let's just show my desktop. No, it's not going to work either. Let's just close this out. This is this is an exciting thing I'm doing, isn't it? Isn't this, isn't this cool, guys? <laughs> All right. Still not a thing. All right, you know what? Skip this. It's not working. It's not working. It's not worth it. Not worth it, man. Not worth it. All right. <laughs> Get myself back in order here. But it's cool. Take my word for it. That thing I was trying to do is cool. Um, I see a map of Cruxcraft. I, I do. I, I should try and figure that out. It looks really cool. Like, if I can figure out how to get it to work. I may... I don't know why it wasn't showing up for us. But it's very cool. Um, um, very, very cool. Um, Shock says, is this a size you can upload to Twitter? That's always not. Well, it's not an image. It's actually a Google... Um, it uses the Google Maps API. So you can, like, zoom in and move around. But it's... Um, and I know that it says that you can upload it, and then other people can do it too, which is pretty cool. Pretty cool. Um, but, um, it's also like five and a half gigabytes, so it's kind of, kind of big. I'm going to go ahead and save quick. I should probably just save and quit. Um, because I want to try and show this, but I don't know why it's not showing up nicely on here. I might give it another try, though. What do you guys think? Would you like to see another try? Because I'm probably about wrapping this up, but I'd love to give a quick little demo of that. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and close this out. We got most of our, our Animal Crossing business tended to, but I'd love to give a quick little tour. Give a quick little tour. Uh, Shock says I had the Firefox crash. It wasn't uh, Firefox actually. I tried to get it going and it wasn't quite um wasn't quite working for me. So it's not just you or Firefox. It's um it's not you. It's me. But let's try. Let's give this one more try. One more try. Actually, hang on one second. Alex needs something, and then I'm gonna be right back to give this a go. Hang tight. Okay, 
that kid ne deserves a round of applause because he's been such a good boy for this stream. He's been so good, so well behaved. All right, let's try to see if I can make this not just be a black, um, black screen of death, as um, who's it? Sundream, yeah, called it the black stream, a uh, black screen of death. Can I make it not a black screen of death? Um, doesn't look like it wants to. Hi, it crashed my screen screen again, or my uh, stream rather. So, <laughs> um, a oh, black stream of doom says sending. Thank you. So yeah, this. Um, hopefully, hopefully this is working well. Um, I've been crashing out in and out of it a couple of times here. So, anyways, I'm going to... looks like now you can be able to see it, finally, which is good news. I just want to adjust this so I can see the chat, too. You'll be able to see it double, which is going to be a little bit weird, but... Eh, I guess it works. Actually, now it might let me... Um, now it might let me, because it's not being so... so derpy. Um... Let's just change this around, and it might now actually let me capture this. I don't know why. <laughs> okay, whatever I'm doing, I'm, I'm trying too hard. Apparently, it keeps crash. It, OBS, my streaming program, keeps closing down on me. So anyways, this should be visible. Yep, okay. Looks like you can see this. Maybe not the highest quality, but um, this is the CruxCraft server. <laughs> Shady says, clap, clap, clap for Alex. Fantastic. Awesome. Um, oh, Total Wizards here. Awesome. We're actually just wrapping up um, Animal Crossing. So this is the CruxCraft server. And as you can see, this everything that's shown is every chunk that's been loaded. That's why it's kind of a spidery pattern here. But the main action, you can zoom in down here. As you can see, this is Seaside and all my projects up in here. Um, over here is the unnamed village, the Church of Cobble, all that stuff. Up here, this is... Um, Shady's first base. Oh, the stream crashed for Shady. Oh, no, it crashed for, I think, me too. It's been... I don't even honestly know if anyone's hearing me right now. If you're hearing this at the moment, give a give a shout quick here. And hang on one second, folks. Okay. Um, there we go. All right, so yeah, if, if anyone can hear me, let me know, just because I'm not entirely convinced that I'm not just talking to myself here. It says I'm streaming, but who knows? So yeah, so here's the main village, and over here you can see, um, that's Wolfgang's place. That's the art gallery that Hideyoshi's working on. This is Kendra's base. She hasn't been on for a while, but it still looks so cool. This tower over here is a build that, um, Wolfgang was working on. And over here, um... Um, this is, uh, Shady's new place. This is Shady's new place over here, which it, he's added a few more things since I, since I made this. It's a little, it's updated as of, like, yesterday morning, I think. So, very cool. But yeah, like, you can see over here, the, uh, iron farm just kind of hanging out there. Okay, cool, we can hear me. Awesome, awesome, glad to hear, <laughs> glad to hear that you guys can hear me. So yeah, and like, I love being able to see this and just look around all the stuff. Like, I, I want to find a way to get this online so other people can just browse around and see it. Up here, from here, this is the main village. Up here is Ghostwood, where Quill does all his, all his stuff. There's the graveyard. And over here, this is Hideyoshi's work in progress, which looks amazing. He always is such a good builder. Um, somewhere on the desert, I see something like a Hall of Heroes being built. Yeah, that, um, is that this thing? Because that's, I'm not sure what Wolfgang was doing over here, but it looks really cool. Um, <laughs> oh, um, uh, Potato says, this is not Animal Crossing. Right, I know, I just was finishing up my Animal Crossing stream and showing off something quick for my, um, for my Minecraft server. And all the way over here, there's, there's, um, Ghostwood. All the way up here is, um, 
Quill's little island that he's working on. The um, show shock my old base. Yeah, I'll show you that again quick. It's over right up over here. Yeah, up there by the main village near all the action. <laughs> Shock says, I'll see a giant missile in the mi middle of the um, desert. Yeah, I don't know. I think he was going to build something more on top of this, and this was just like the lead up to it. Um, but it's pretty cool. Um, pretty cool. So yeah, that's, in a nutshell, that's the, uh, that's the server. So hang tight here. Okay, since I've already been changing everything around, I just switch over my face since I closed down most of my Animal Crossing stuff. Thank you all so much for um for joining me. <laughs> Sendream says <laughs> Animal Crossing featuring Cruxcraft. That's about right. That's about right. So thank you all so much for joining me. It's another fun stream as always, even a little bit a little bit um <laughs> glitchy near the end there with things um <laughs> crashing a bunch. But I got a chance to show you guys that I actually really wanted to show that map. Um so hopefully, I hope you all enjoy this, and uh, let's see, what is tomorrow? Probably Cruxcraft, I would think. Probably be on that server over there. So anyways, that's all for now, folks. Until next time, catch you later, everybody.